Hey guys, and welcome back to Simply Nailer. And in this video, as you can probably tell, I'm doing a Wee Bear Bears nail design. So to start off, as you can see, I'm starting with a base coat. Next up, I'm painting black on my thumb and pinky fingernail. I usually don't mess up this much, but with black it always happens, so here's where having long nails comes in handy. Now for the actual design, I'm using white on my index and ring fingernail. I'm also using this detail brush from Born Pretty. So for the first bear, I'm starting off with what's essentially just an egg shape. The next thing I did for the ears, which were actually pretty hard to do on camera, so that's all I got. <laughs> now for my ring fingernail, I'm doing pretty much the same thing, just a little bit bigger. Luckily, I was able to film the ears here, if you were curious about that. Now, for my middle nail, I'm using brown acrylic paint because I don't have brown nail polish, which actually ended up making the design really difficult to see until I put a top coat on. But it ended up looking good in the end, so I don't really mind. It's just kind of annoying for filming purposes. Anyway, I'm painting essentially the same thing as on my other nails. Now to start making them actually look like theirs, I'm taking black acrylic paint and I'm just going to start off by outlining the first one. Now using a dotting tool, I'm taking the smallest end and I'm just doing a dot for each of the eyes. Now I'm taking that same end of the dotting tool and I'm going to do like two and a half dots for the nose. Now going back to my detail brush, I'm just going to do a slanted line for the mouth. So next up is the arm and originally I did it too big and it went off of my nail so I just repainted it smaller here. Next for my middle nail I'm starting off the same way as on my other nail even though it's hard to see. I'm starting off with a black outline. Next I'm doing the same thing, just one dot for each eye and it was so difficult to tell if the eyes were in the right place because I couldn't see. And then I'm doing the same thing for the nose as well. Next up with my detail brush again, I'm going to do a line above the nose and next to it for the snout. Finally for the mouth, I'm going to start off with the black half circle shape.
Now with my white acrylic paint, I'm just going to do three teeth on the top of the mouth. Now for the tongue, I'm starting off with a white base and then I'm going over it with a light pink acrylic paint. Now for the final and most time consuming bear, I'm starting off with this gray nail polish. I'm going to fill in the ears, I'm going to do circles around the eyes, and then the bottom of the bear, I'm going to fill in and do little, like, circle things for the arms. Now, I said this was the most time consuming bear because it took so long for the gray to dry. Like, all the other nails were dry and I could just immediately do the outline, but this one I had to wait another like hour. Now, onto the actual outline. This is actually the most difficult outline as well. Like, the lines just kept going so crooked and I don't know why. Next, like the other nails, I'm just going to do a single black dot for each of the eyes. Now for the snout, I'm going to start at the bottom of the gray of the right eye and I'm going to go across the other one and swoop down a little bit. And for the nose, it's going to be just the same as for the other two bears. Now I'm just going to go and do a slanted line for the mouth. Finally, to finish up, I'm going to outline the paws. Now I'm applying a quick dry top coat and this was the most satisfying part because you could finally see the design on my middle nail. I was so scared the entire time that you wouldn't be able to see it. Finally, the last step is to apply a matte top coat on every nail. Well, that is all guys. Thanks for watching. To see more videos like this, subscribe. Also leave a like if you like this video and don't forget to comment down below your suggestions for my next design. Bye!